G'day everybody, Where's Wally here. Today I'm going to do a little experiment. This video shows two balloons in a car, one with air, heavier than air, and one with helium, so it's lighter than air. Now I'm going to manipulate just one variable and that variable cell shall henceforth be known as the independent variable. Okay, Riley? Now the independent variable in this case is an acceleration which is applied by the car by the gas pedal or by the brake or by the steering wheel or in the, as in the case of the control nothing at all and then finally i'm just going to have a look at what would happen if we're parked on a slope so the front of the car is sticking up at 45 degrees right here we go okay test one we have an acceleration and deceleration viewed from the front Let's repeat that, another acceleration, but this time viewed from the side. Let's repeat that. Now we'll have an acceleration applied as we go around the corner. Let's repeat that. And I didn't have an uphill picture, but we know exactly what it's going to look like, just like this, sitting at a 45 degree angle, pointing straight up. The balloons are going to go straight up and straight down. So we can see on the results here that the helium balloon always moved forward when the car was accelerating and moved backwards when it was decelerating. And it moved towards the side, the opposite direction to the air balloon as it was going around the corner. So we can see that it responds very predictably to the acceleration supplied by the vehicle. Okay, but wait, what's happening here with these other tests, the one where it's stationary? How come the balloons are both pointing up and down at that point? And like, even though we parked the car up a hill, it's a bit of a thought experiment, but you can see it's gonna be pointing straight up and down. What's going on there? And as we think about this, why are these balloons pointing at 45 degrees and not straight out to the side? Well, I guess that's because there's actually a second acceleration present. And this one, the acceleration, is called... Gravity! 